Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, just making a short video here because I forgot to edit it into the other videos. So, just a quick video on removing the air conditioning compressor and bracket. Uh, it's a short little video, but figured I'd add it in. After this video, you're going to be getting the shifter removal, and then after that, you're going to get another video taking the transmission out. And I already edited that video, so I can already tell you there's a little error in there. My GoPro decided to commit treason on me. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this short video. And let's get to taking that bracket out. All right, guys, we're going to disconnect the air conditioning now. So there were two bolts underneath, which were long as hell. They're right here. I could not get them on camera. So skip those two. They're a pain in the ass to get. Uh, and then there's two here. There's one here, one here. That should disconnect the compressor from the bracket. And I'm going to remove the bracket separately because when I pull the engine, I don't want any of this stuff getting caught up on anything and getting in my way. So let's try and bang that out real quick. Oh, and by the way, 15 millimeter socket. Okay, so these are small little guys, nothing crazy. All right, back those four bolts out. It dropped the compressor. Now there's two bolts down here, boom, boom, and then two up here, and that should remove this whole bracket and get it out of the way. And then we just leave the air conditioning compressor just sitting right here. And these appear to be 15 millimeter bolts also. Let's see. Yep, 15 millimeter bolts holding that on. So let's get this out. There you go, so we got the uh, bracket out for the air conditioning pump. Let's see if I can orient this the right way. So it was like that. Uh, just a quick note, uh, the two bolts on the inside, on the bottom, on the inside for the bracket, there is a ground attached to this guy right here. So if you're taking this out, make sure you, when you put it back together, I don't know if you can see it. Let's see if I can point it out for you. Yeah, so this right here where my finger is, that's a ground strap. So if you ever take that off, make sure you put it back on because you will have little gremlins going on. <clears throat> All right, so that's it for the air conditioning bracket. Air conditioning pump is just sitting off to the side. Should give us plenty of clearance. I don't know how I'm removing the engine yet. I don't know if I'm just removing this one bolt or unbolting it from the block and lifting it. We'll figure that out when we get to it. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Nice little short one, like two minutes, three minutes. So hope you enjoyed it. And maybe it'll be useful because that thing would suck to try and get out. So like and subscribe and Watch for the next videos. Going to have the uh, probably in the next day or two, going to be start taking the engine apart and uh, making some content for that. And also, I got to do a little review of my Jeep so I could get that out in the world and uh, maybe LS swap it. That'd be fun. I've kind of wanted to do that for a while. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.